I grew up in the 80s and 90s watching Big East basketball. You know, you're talking about some of the most iconic basketball in the modern era. To be part of the league is so much fun. You have more experience, you have more toughness, you have more grit, and uh, the double round robin certainly makes it a bear. Well, for us, year two is about continuing to build our culture. How do we act? Are we on time? Are we enthusiastic? Are we appreciative? How do we interact? Do we look each other in the eye? Do we treat each other with respect? Do we call each other out when it's necessary? And how do we respond? We play a great game, we win by a lot of points, or we have a tough game or a couple tough games in a row. How do we respond to that? The great thing about player development is that it's really personal development. You better be about relationships and care and value relationships, otherwise you're gonna stick out like a sore thumb here. I was raised by a single mom. My coaches put their arm around me. I never forget the impact that my high school coach had on me. So the relationships are really, really important to me and that's a big part of why I coach. One of the hottest teams in the country continues to roll. Cam Jones, Stevie Mitchell, David Joplin, Oso Iguodaro, Tyler Kolick. These guys have all been here, Omax Prosper now, for a little over a year, about a year and a half almost. There's a foundation in place relationship-wise and also understanding the level of work that is required. Cam Jones is a unique player and person. He doesn't have a lot of BS around him. He does a great job in school and he loves this game of basketball and he loves his teammates. We talked about Oso. He, to me, is one of the more unique players in our league. He's going to handle the ball, I would say, John, more than any 6'10 player in the country. Can he and we be a more confident player and team in December than we were in November because of the experiences that we just had? Can we be a more confident team in January than we were in December? And so on, leading to hopefully playing our best basketball in March. I just love the game. I love the sound of the ball bouncing on the floor. I love the sound of the ball going through the net. The adversity that the game creates, the lessons that the game creates, to get a chance to be a part of basketball at this level. Playing the garden, for me, is a really special experience and I don't take it for granted. In my office down the hall, there's a picture an image of Madison Square Garden. On the marquee, it says Big East Champions, and there's a Marquette logo. That actually has not been done. No one's ever won the tournament in Madison Square Garden wearing a Marquette uniform. Our job is to change that.